Today we are looking at Blue Skies out of Best Songs Ever from Hal Leonard's Super Easy Songbook series. What's great about the book is that the note names are written into the notes, the chord shapes are given at the top, and the layout is nice and big and easy to read. To note, learn the right hand part alone first so that you know this right hand very well before you try adding the left hand. One, two, three, four. E, two, E, two, hold, two. Two, three, four, one, two. Two, two, hold, two. Two, three, four. Two, three, repeat. Two, two, hold, two. Two, three, four, one, two. Two, two, hold, two. Second ending, two, three, four, wait, two, three, four. Two, 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 hold, two. Two, three, four, hold, two. Two, two, hold, two. Two, three, four, hold, two, three, four. So we're going to be going first with the chords. It's a good idea to have a look through the piece and to play the chords in the order that you're going to find them counting them for as long as you'll need them. One chord per bar. And we count. E minor. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. A seven. Two, three, four. A seven. The left hand can play the chord pulsing on each beat of the bar. There are four beats in the bar, so we would go one, two, One other option is to take the left hand part and divide it up so that we play a pinky note alternating with the rest of the notes. That would sound one.
notice I stopped playing my left hand for a moment when my right hand had quicker notes. It's a kind of rule that we go by when right hand's got a lot of movement we give lefts to the left hand, when right hand's pretty static we let the left hand fill the space. So just giving you the beginning again. Also means that I don't need the C minor chord where it says nothing but blue skies. Right, when we get to the middle section it's nice to change things up a little bit and here I would probably use single chords and I would play them on the first and third beat. So one, two, nice introduction might be the E minor chord played for two bars alone with your left hand. Notice to finish that I use the G and the B. The lowest note I want to hear is a G because that's a G chord and the highest note I want to hear is a G. All right.